Hey there, I'm Sarah Graham, and I want to thank you for checking out this video series that is all about how to make big moves and relocate without losing your mind. Uh, yes, it's going to involve some pets. <laughs> this is my cat, Tiger Lily, who will be making some time appearances. I've written an ebook e guide that will be available soon. So I thought it would be fun to do this video series so we could get to know each other and you can become familiar with the topics that I cover and that will hopefully help you. So a little bit about me. I am a yoga teacher, I'm an editor, I'm a three-time relocator. I grew up in Bermuda and then moved to Toronto, Canada for university uh, when I was 18. Stayed in the city for almost 20 years. In 2011, I met an Italian. He got a job in Prague, so early 2014, we moved to the Czech Republic. And now we are getting set to relocate to Uppsala, Sweden uh, in about a week. So who is this video series for? I believe it is for the lifestyle migrants to be. Uh, whether you're moving nationally or internationally. Uh, I think people who have already relocated might also get a kick out of it. Um, same goes for the guide. Again, that will be available in a few weeks and I'll give you a bit more information about that at the end of this video. Number one, give yourself enough time. It's all about time, it's all about lists. Keep yourself organized. Before leaving Toronto, I started about six weeks uh, before we had to be out of the house we were living in, uh, selling my stuff through uh, Facebook, through my own blog, uh, through Craigslist, <clears throat> etc. Uh, obviously, if you have larger assets like a car, uh, your own home that you own, you want to start earlier. Consider using an agency like MaxSold.com. These guys are throughout Canada and the US. They will come over to your home, give you an appraisal for free, and if you like them, uh, they will sell your stuff for a commission, which kind of is great because they take a lot off your hands. I personally had a ton of success using Kijiji in Toronto, a uh, little bit less random than Craigslist, um, just better quality uh, requests coming through. Leaving Prague, I found out about this great classified Facebook page for the Czech Republic and sold a couple of things like super fast that way. Another idea is to create a Facebook event where you can invite those friends that you think will give your stuff a good home. Uh, I caution against using your own personal page to do this stuff because it's not very targeted take photos of the stuff as it is in your home, uh, use a lovely Instagram filter. This is easy to do without actually posting to your Instagram feed. Uh, maybe we'll do a tutorial on that later on if people want. Um, but yeah, you want to put all the descriptions with the, those photos. If it's a, you got a bunch of IKEA stuff, maybe you want to just link to the, the IKEA page that talks about the product, gives the measurements and all that stuff so you don't actually have to get down and measure everything but um, people will ask you to do that so if it's not IKEA you don't have somewhere to send people with the information then just do it off the bat. Going back to Facebook uh, and that event um, we created an event, an event before we were leaving Prague we actually had a little soiree uh, last night here in our apartment and what I did was um, I found these cute little cloud post-it notes and I just pinned them or stuck them to uh, a bunch of items that were still for sale. Obviously we have a few last things to move and I just wanted it to pop at the party so people could see that <clears throat> what was left. And this uh, definitely was a good idea. A couple, couple pillows left the house. So post-its, a marker, a few pins, and you've got a strategy that also works if you're not home during the day and maybe your apartment's being shown uh, while you're out of the house. Uh, this makes it obvious to prospective new tenants uh, that might potentially also take stuff off your hands. 
So I really hope you enjoyed this video. There's definitely more to come. Please do send me questions, post them in the comments below. If you subscribe there, you'll get notifications on the next video, uh, which will be all about packing your stuff. Got some great tips for you in that. Then we will also send you information about when the book is ready, of course. And I love subscribers and I'll be extra generous to you. So you'll get additional tips and ideas um, that will help you make big moves and relocate without losing your mind. Thanks and see you next time.